What's up everyone, it's Sarah. Today I'm showing you guys how to make your own homemade stickers. I sh gave a little quick tutorial on my 25 things to do when you're bored at home video, but I'm gonna do a separate video that shows it nice and thought out and better and more professional. I also have some great videos coming up the next few weeks, so stay tuned for that. There would have been an amazing video coming out this week, but something bad happened and I can't get it to work, so hopefully that will work. Um, but if not, there's still some other ones, some other good ones coming out. So I hope you guys enjoy. To make your own homemade sticker, you're only gonna need some printouts or you could just draw on them and then you just wanna cut around them. You're also gonna need some parchment or baking paper. I just took out a nice piece. And you're also gonna need some packing tape. If you don't have packing tape, I recommend using um, scotch tape, just any clear tape, but packing tape really works the best because it's big and clear and it's also easy to work with. So you're also gonna need some scissors. The first step is to take your packing tape and just lie a piece straight on the baking paper. Now cut it. If your cutout is smaller than the packing tape, you're only gonna need one piece. But if it's not, keep layering pieces side by side each other. I have the packing tape big enough so that if I put a cutout on, it's still bigger than the cutout. So I'm just going to put on the cutout and then we're gonna layer packing tape over it too. Okay, so the cutout is completely sandwiched in by two layers of tape. Now what we're gonna do is cut it out, leaving a little clear edge around it. And if you don't leave a clear edge around the sticker, it will not stick at all. It will just fall apart, so make sure to have a little outline of the baking paper and tape. Okay, so as you can see, I left a little outline. Then just peel off the parchment paper. It's gonna be super, super sticky. And then you can just stick it on something. It's also pretty thick, so it will stay on easily. And boom, let me just try and get this off. Did you hear that? It's super, super sticky. So. I'm gonna make a few more of these and I'll be right back. Okay, so I made a few more. So here's the penguin one. Um, it came off, came off the wax paper. Um, but I have two foxes and a little bat. And what I'm gonna do is stick it to my math notebook because it's really dull. And it does come off because it is plastic, but it also sticks super, super well. As you can see, it just came off there. I'm gonna rearrange it a little bit. Perfect. And this is my math notebook. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you liked the video. Um, and I'll see you guys next time. Stay tuned, bye.